Hey wine friends, welcome back to my channel. So today we are going to talk a little bit about some of the flyest decanters that I have been seeing out there in the market right now. And you guys know it's getting ready to be entertainment season. We're all ready to head outside so we can have our outdoor gatherings and our chic tables and all that good stuff out on the decks and patios. And there's nothing more impressive than a super cute decanter. So I am going to share with you some of my favorites that I found online. And I guess this is kind of like a luxury wish list part two because I want them all. <laughs> if you're interested in seeing some of the nice decanters that you can pick up for yourself this spring and summer, then definitely keep watching this video. And if you're somebody who enjoys wine and fashion and lifestyle and you know, all that good kind of content, then go ahead and subscribe to this video, subscribe to this channel and like this video because there's a whole lot more where this is coming from. First step on this list of fly decanters is the Twister Aerator. Now, this aerator actually comes in a set. So not quite a decanter, but a decanter does come with it. It's the shape of this aerator that really got my attention and how pretty it looked next to the decanter. So if you have some, you know, guests when you when they first arrive and you want to let one of your wines breathe and the other one, you kind of want to cheat coat it a little bit and get there a little quicker, then this aerator is definitely one you want to pick up. I promised the rest of the decanters, but I couldn't leave this baby off the list because it is so gorgeous. So I hope that you grab this and make sure you tag me when you use it so that I can post it on my stories. All right, so the second decanter on this list is actually my favorite of all of them. Um, it's the Fusion Break Resistant Duck Decanter. Now, the shape of this decanter explains the name of it. It definitely looks like the shape of a duck, uh, more like when a duck is like on a pond and it's like, you know, just kind of cruising, right. taking it easy. That's what this decanter looks like. But the fact that you'd have a decanter basically like laying across your table waiting to serve your wine it's just fly like I, I saw this and I instantly this was a decanter that inspired this video so y'all definitely check this one out and to me the price point is definitely fair considering how dope it is next up on this list is the Medina wine aerator but this is definitely a decanter you will be able to pour your wine into this beauty and let it kind of breathe without having to pour it immediately. But the shape of this decanter is what allows the wine to aerate as it heads to the bottom of this glass. Let me tell you, I just like the look of it. It's very pretty. The twist in it reminds me of a woman's body. And it's just such like a more complicated decanter than the usual ones or like my little baby that I have here beside me. It's I just love the shape of it. It's beautiful. It's elegant. And I think this is a good dinner time decanter. It's a good conversation piece, I think, similar to the duck one because the shape is just really beautiful. So this one is one that is definitely top of the list to have for 2021. Next up on our list of decanters, I'm going to read this one directly from my phone because I feel like if I'm not looking at it, I'm going to say it wrong. The Luigi... Bormo Bormioli Crescendo 48 ounce carafe. So this one's really pretty. I think that this one is a nice one as well. It'll be really pretty to serve from in spring. If you have a big furry daughter like I do, um, then you might want to be careful because um, it seems a little like you don't want to sit this anywhere near the edge of the table because it's going to fall off. And really any of these decanters, you want to be careful. But this one was just, it, it had a simplicity, it had an elegance that I thought definitely deserved to make this list of fly decanters. Next up on this list is the Magnifico Thumb Wine Decanter. Now, what I like about this one is it looks like real, you know, regular, just a little basic decanter. But what I like about it is when you're pouring it, you actually can fit your thumb into this decanter. Now, I know it's like not a big deal, but it's just kind of cool. The shape is really neat and it's better than just, you know, a 
boring to canter. <laughs> I think it's pretty fly. Um, the simplicity of this, again, it is what adds to the elegance of it, and I think it's what makes it make the cut for this fly wine decanter list. The French Riviera wine decanter comes in a set. What I love about this is this one to me just screams luxury. It's just the look of it. So of the list of the decanters that made this list of fly wine decanters, this one gives me like dinner party decanter. This is just elegant. This is that baby that you take out and you look like you have been sipping on the greatest and the flyest and the baddest wines in the game, okay? It has a glass ball that goes on top of it. And I think it's the look of the glass ball too at the top of the decanter that's just simply beautiful. I think this is one that you add to your luxury wish list and that you definitely pick up before the end of 2021. It's gonna look great at the Christmas table. Last but not least on this list of super fly decanters is the Vera Shop wine decanter. Now this one is probably the most plain of all of the decanters but I will say what's simply beautiful about it is the, the top. So the top of it is very gorgeous and I think it seals it off from getting too much air so that if you poured this and wanted to enjoy it the next day you could by the look of it. Um, but the shape of the decanter top is just so so beautiful. And so I know for sure that this is one that deserves to make the list just because it's simple elegance that will go well with any meal. I hope that you enjoyed this really gorgeous list of fly wine decanters that I have put together for you in this video. I want to hear from you down below. Have you found a decanter lately that you absolutely just could not resist picking up? If so, I want to hear where you got it and I want you to tell me all about it in the comments because I might just add it to my next list. Thanks so much for watching and thanks for tuning in. Cheers!